Hey, what's up with it? It's your boy, Brent C. So I just wanted to do a quick video today about um, when you get through this tunnel of success. So at the end of the day, guys, um, money matters, but I'm not going to be a guy that's going to lie to you and tell you that money doesn't fucking matter because it does. But make the money. Don't let the money make you. Mike Tyson even said... Uh, he had like 300 million in the bank at some point. And then uh, he, he just blew it all. You know, he, he just blew it all. And he was like, man, he's way more happier just being a, a right at a regular millionaire or 800,000, whatever he making, than he was at uh, 300 million. You got a bunch of leeches. A lot of women just want to deal with you because of the money status, what you can do for them. You know, people look at you as, um, what you can do for them, like strictly. Not just women, many men too, family members, everybody. I definitely see some of that uh, now with like family members and friends and stuff like that, uh, asking for favors and stuff, which I wasn't getting asked like that beforehand. I don't mind helping people, that's cool, because people have helped me. But just understand Sorry, I just got out of work. Just understand, when people find out that you that you done came up, that they are going to, like, be reaching out. People that you ain't heard from in forever. I had a guy hit me up, actually, that I used to be real cool with him. I ain't heard from him in years, like six years. And, man, he, he seen me coming up, man, and he hit me up, like, status and money and all that, man. People, people gonna hit you up, man. They see you doing better, man. They gonna, they gonna come. The leech is coming, man. Another topic, people talk about the confidence on um, men gain when grabbing a lot of money and stuff like that or touching more money. Look, man, um, that's true for a lot of men. For me, it really didn't make me any more confident. I was already confident. I just feel like my confidence is like 100% justifiable now. But whereas I might have had a 95% confidence already when I was broke, now it's just 100%. Like, cause I was already getting chicks when I was broke. I had the baddest chicks I ever had in my life when I was broke. Because I had the the charisma, I had the swag, I had the, I, I'm in shape. Like I, I work on my body game. The sex game is good, you know. I'm exciting. I know. I know like how to talk to women. I know what they like. I know. I be knowing how to get in their head and like deep dive in their mind and stuff like that. And but it's like it's from a like a genuine place. Like that's just really me. Like my conversation skills have just developed, and I just be knowing like how to talk to women in like a real way to where like they they always be like oh i ain't never met nobody like you or nobody so raw and real like you so it's just like it's just a hundred but at the end of the day you know all of that led me to like being with my old lady now i'm a hundred percent cool with being purple pill because i understand that men need women and women need men you know a lot of red pill people will tell you you know all men don't really need women but yet they still fucking with chicks I mean, yes, we not, you know, you don't fuck with them in a way of, oh, I'm trying to marry them or knock them up, get them pregnant. But at the end of the day, I mean, you still gonna want some ass. It just is what it is. Just like all these boss chicks and stuff, they still gonna want some dick. That's just real. So, I mean, we all gonna need each other at the end of the day. So, I don't really mind it. I, 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 I locked in with some deeper understanding stuff. You know, one of my OGs taught me some real deep shit. Um, and I just see things from a whole different perspective when it comes to a man being with woman, yin and yang. Because I feel like it's better for the family. You know, everybody have the same mom and dad and shit like that. I don't want different baby mamas, and I just don't want that, especially in today's world. And they could talk about Western society versus like Saudi Arabia and um, all these other countries and stuff like that, India and all that. But man, women are women. I feel like if you can't control your bitch here, then you can't control it, and you don't deserve 
women overseas because over here is survival of the fittest and only the most player of the player and most pimp and the pimp of the most pimp uh, survive over here. And, and I, I'm so glad that we deal with Western women because women are women. Biologically, they still have to be, they still desire to be tamed by a true alpha male. It's just real. If you alpha enough, you or if you are masculine enough, you will put a woman in her feminine energy. You know, you will continuously dominate that masculine acting woman because she's just acting. She's not really masculine. She's just acting masculine because there's so many feminine beta males around her that she no she nobody's commanding her and making her act feminine. Women, all women want to be feminine and feel like a little princess till they do. They want to be dominated. But the thing is, there's so many weak men out here that are not doing it. Guys out here get money and then they leave with their wallet. Baby, I do this for you. Do this. I'm not doing none of this shit. If you don't want me while I'm broke, fuck you. Because I saw women on my potential. I had everything I needed as a man. I just did, I lacked finances, but these chicks knew that I was on my way. And my girl held it down for me when I was on my way. Now I'm up. You know, as y'all know, I'm an x-ray tech. I graduated last year, 2022 May. Graduated making 50,000, you know what I'm saying? Took a travel job. I was in Mississippi, now I'm in Illinois. Took a travel job, they 13 weeks apiece, three months. Um. Triple your pay. They gonna at least double your pay back home. So at this point, I'm well into the six figure range, but I'm not arrogant, I'm humble. Cause I understand this shit could be cut any day. That's just how life works. I'm not thinking about, oh man, I got a Toyota right now. Let me go get um, a Mercedes or a Charger. I'm not thinking about that. Cause who I'm flashing for? I don't need to flash for chicks. I had nines. Eight and a halves, eights, seven and a half, sevens. I had all of those before I got this money. I had the baddest chicks I ever had when I was broke staying on my mom. Honest to God, no lie. So at the end of the day, man, um, it's all about your mouthpiece and stuff like that. Having money doesn't mean women are just gonna fall in your lap because that's just bullshit. How they gonna know you got it? You gonna have to open your mouth and you gonna have to wear it. You're going to have to wear big chains or you're going to have to buy nice flashy cars and clothes and stuff like that. All that money you're spending just to attract women. You should just deal with organic chicks that have organic attraction to you. Because all you're attracting if you do that and leave with your wallet is gold diggers. It's just not worth it. You know, I'm the type of person, man, I'm not thinking about other women and shit. I'm thinking about what can I do for me and my girl as a collective. I know we want kids, so I'm looking at it like, okay, what can I do for the family? I need to have six months to a year um, emergency fund saved up. I want to have enough money for her pregnancy and when the baby gets here, pampers and all of that. I want to have money set aside for that. I want to have money set aside for a big ass down payment on the house because I want to pay my house off early. I don't want to be stuck in a house note for 30 years. My car is paid off. I got a gas saver. I got a Toyota. I mean, it's okay. I don't need to ride around flashy. I try to live as simple as I can. Because the more simple you live, the more money you keep. Now, once you get real, real rich and you got passive income and all of that, if you want to splurge a little bit, I like C8 Corvettes. I might get a C8 Corvette eventually, but right now it's not making sense to me. And guys, also... I don't mind helping people, you know, that really need to be helped. If I see somebody in front of me and they card is declining in the grocery store or something, I hit it. Um, I'm not finna do it for like $200 or nothing. I don't care how much money I'm making, but uh, you just on your own at that point because it's the principle. But if it's something small, uh, you know, like five, 10 bucks, oh, I, I take care of it, you know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, I've had people do it for me. You know, it is what it is, but I'm not finna just be out here just, oh yeah, man, I'm finna like throw all my money away and help everybody because then I'd be broke. You do have to help yourself first. 
you know, you do have to help your situation first because how the hell are you going to help others when you ain't helped yourself? But if I do see little, like, little windows to help people, I do it for them because I'm real like that. That's just honest and thorough and genuine. So, guys, just use this as motivation. I'm not going to get on here and be arrogant and y'all need to get on y'all shit, blah, blah, blah. You know, if you ain't making six figures, you ain't shit, love. You making 50, 40,000 a year, you know, you an average earner. You don't deserve no women. That's just bullshit, bro. I was just there like two months ago. So at the end of the day, man, and before then, I was there like seven, eight months ago, was only making like $13 an hour. So guys, I always just keep a level head. Don't let that money go to your head, man. Don't get, don't start touching money and taking all these random trips and buying all these clothes and cars and creating extra debt. Man, focus on getting debt free. Focus on creating some passive income. Focus on buying a house, paying it off, and um, setting yourself up. If you want a legacy like kids and stuff, focus on what's gonna really be important for them.